In the last lesson, we saw how to import all of the functions from a module into a program. In this lesson, we're going to learn how to only import the particular functions that we want from a module into a program without bringing everything in. So first, let's look at the module that we're working with, just to refresh your memory. And you'll see we have three functions, average, square, and square root. So this time we're going to build a program that first only brings in the average function, then we'll demonstrate how to import average and square, but without importing the square root function. So we're going to start a new program. We're going to call it Newton test 2py And so we're going to say, from Newton, import average. Before, to import everything, we wrote import star or asterisk. But all we want to do is import the average function this time. So we'll import the average, create a couple of variables, and then we're going to display the average. All right, so let's save that. Go back to our command prompt window, type Newton test 2py and we see that the average is 138.5. To demonstrate that that was the only function that was brought in, let's try to also display the square root of 9. Now watch what happens. So it printed the average as 138.5, but then when we tried to compute the square root, it gave us an error and said square root is not defined. That's because we didn't import it into our program. Let's say we want to work with both the average function and the square function. Here we can add a comma, and then the next function that we want square after average. So now we're saying from the Newton module, import just the average function and the square function. So let's modify this program a little bit. I'll just make comments here. Let's say average is equal to average num1, num2. So now we can compute the square of the average. Like so. So let's save the program. Let's clear the screen. And so we have the average and then the square of the average. So to summarize, we can import only the functions that we want from a module by specifying them instead of the asterisk to import all the functions. So for example, if I wanted just the average function, I would write from Newton import average. And if I wanted average and square, I'd write from Newton import average and square. So with that, we wrap up this lesson on user-defined modules, and we're ready to move to the next lesson where we're going to talk about module namespaces.